What are we doing? What are we doing? Sup, y'all? Sup, y'all? Not crazy. Anyways, I ordered a boom arm and I was just gonna unbox it, hook it up to my setup, and use it. And I'm like, why not make a video review of it? So that's what we're gonna do. Today, we're taking a look at the the newer low profile boom arm. It doesn't have a like a name to it or anything, just pneumatic low profile. So I'm gonna name it the newer brown boom arm because it's in a brown box. No glam, no glitter, no just crazy stuff. Just you and me hanging out. Let's go ahead and unbox this thing. Have some fun. It's a boom arm. I mean, how how fancy does it need to be? Uh, bark from obscure mics. He always just, you know, just jumps right in and says, hey, it's a boomerm. 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 So let's just do a boomerm review. And I don't, I can't find my, can't find my knife. So we're just going to use a drill to cut tape. You ever done that before? I do that all the time. Just, uh, yeah, look at that. Uh, uh, yep, mm hmm. Ooh, put a hole in it. Can we, can we get it out yet? Can we get it out? Come on. It's just, this is just tape, man. Come on, let me in. I hate these childproof boxes. That didn't work. Shocker. All right, but that's okay. I found my kniffy. That's right. I said kniffy, not knife. It's got a K in it. And if I have to take the time to write a K when I spell this word out, I'm going to use it. Kniffy. Open the box and uh, what what comes in the box? There's a boom arm in here covered in plastic. So we're reinventing the wheel here with our unboxing videos. Sorry, Dave. Sorry. The way he approaches it. Just so awesome. I'm so not you, bro. So not you. Uh, we unboxed. We opened. There's a boom arm in here. It's got plastic on it. And uh, it's got other stuff. We're just going to get rid of it because we get some literature. Great Odin's Raven. Just in case you were wondering. We've got ourselves, uh, man, this is heavy duty. Heavy duty. What is, oh my goodness. Mm, that's some girth to it. Uh, a desk mount. Want some ASMR? You want some ASMR? Let's go. Let's go. Ready? Anyways, this is a pretty massive mount here. This thing is no joke. Okay. Cleared out some desk space, tilted my desk a little bit so you guys can see as we're going what this thing can do. Uh, I'm going to just go out on a limb here and say this is going to grab onto my desk and hold it in place. <laughs> Attached to the desk. <laughs> just in case you were wondering. I mean, the tension is building here. Uh, box with some tools. Tools. Here's the low profile section of the boom room. Ooh. So this comes apart, by the way. <laughs> so uh, the boom arm midsection attaches to the base just in case you were wondering what to do next. You just you just take it and you put it in the hole. Okay. What else is there? I think there's only one more piece. One more piece. Let's unsheathe this thing, shall we? So you got some girth to this thing. All right. I guess, I guess, I mean, I maybe need to go to the instructions. I'm not sure. I'm just going to go on a limb here and say without having to read instructions, okay, that you just take this piece and you put it in the hole, okay? It's in the hole. Or is it? Okay, there we go. It's in the hole. So we've got a boomer. And, uh, <laughs> dude, this thing. Dude, you want to talk about mobility in a boom arm? Wow. I have no words other than this is fun. It's the little things in life that, that we enjoy, isn't it? Anyways, there we go. Boom arm. All right, so uh, shall we test it with a mic on it just to see if it can hold a mic? I'm, I'm pretty sure it can because this is like I haven't even adjusted the tension on this thing. And uh, it's it's pretty big. I'm really impressed with this boom arm so far. Just looking at it, I mean, how do you like? What's your desk situation? Doesn't matter. Like this thing just swivels and pivots and turns around like one of those 
little weird thingies that you see on psychiatrist desk that makes you go psychotic and make you need to come back for another appointment because you're staring at that thing just a spinning around. Okay, can I move this? This is this is crazy. I'm, it's like a Ferris wheel. <laughs> appointment because you're staring at that thing just a spinning around you know what i'm talking about blows your mind anyways that's what this thing reminds me of but it's so cool because it's just like whatever's going on on your desk you can contort and twist this thing to fit whatever space you need it to this is cool i like this i like this it's not see i'm hitting this one but i'm not hitting that one that's pretty cool come straight at you okay or down below, if you like that down below shot. Let's go ahead and check out the handling noise of this boom arm. Full disclosure, Niwa did not send me this boom arm. All the thoughts and opinions expressed in this video are mine and mine alone. Got this for me, for my setup. Uh, so yeah, that's why this video is going off the rails and I'm not worried about, worried about it. All right, so we got that out of the way, get back on topic. I see this little, like little trough, this like U-shaped trough. And does this, yep, okay, so you just pinch it, and it comes off, and this is the U-shaped trough I'm talking about, look at that right there, okay, that clips on the bottom, and what does it clip? Clips your XLR cable, keeps it from dangling. Uh, on this piece right here, they're just like U-bolt, or they're just hooks on the bottom, they don't come off, but you can just pull it down a little bit and tuck them in, super, super easy cable management. All right, so I have the original pod mic, the $99 pod mic in the white version. We are now off the RE20, so let me lift this thing out of the shot so I don't hit it or it hit me in the face. I just got all this stuff on my desk. Now, this comes in at about $70 on Amazon, and I am more happy with this boom arm at $70. This is... Oh, man. I just love the versatility, versatility, versatility of this thing. Like whatever I want to do with it. If I need more desk space, like look at that. Boom. Seconds. And now my desk, everything's out of my way. If I don't want it in my shot, I can, voila, get it down here, bring it down, bring the microphone up. The pneumatic section of this boom arm is metal. All right, heavy duty, it's durable. The body feels like plastic. I mean, it looks like plastic, but it feels like metal. I feel like this entire thing is all metal. The handling noise of this boom arm is awesome compared to other boom arms. Like, I don't hear anything. The only thing you hear is the XLR cable getting twisted up. Get yourself a Rode Pod mic where you just got this like flexibility right here to move your mic around. You got the ability to move it left and right on here. You can move it up and down. Then you've got the boom arm that gives you the ability to move it up and down. So you, you see this little silver attachment right here. So if you want to use it to mount lights that go over top of it, that clamp onto this little groove right here and hold it in place. You, I feel like I need to get another one. Uh, if I had to rate this one out of 10, I feel weird saying this, but I'm telling you right now, it's a 10 for me. For $70, this solves all of my problems. Yeah, that tension. Like, that is so cool. All right. Yeah, this is just, this is great. This is tough. And it's tough to move stuff around. So it's like, yes, you can move it, but it's not super flimsy. Like, this is able to hold heavy duty mics. So, yeah, final thoughts on this boom arm. Build quality, love it, all metal everywhere, and just super tough, super tough. I have a lot of confidence in this boom arm to hold anything from NT1s, which are like four pounds when you conclude the shock mount. Anyways, this boom arm excites me. I'm going to wrap this up. Short video. This is the boom arm. This is the newer pneumatic low-profile boom arm. Uh, link in the description down below for you guys to go get it. I absolutely think this is an absolute steal at 70 bucks. This is my new main profile boom arm. I don't, I love other boom arms in my studio, but this checks every single box of what I want out of my boom arm in my setup. Up close, far away, moving stuff around, trying to unbox something on my desk. I can position this however I want and still get this microphone where I need it to be. That's a wrap. 
Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and the notification bell so you guys stay notified when future content goes up because it is a coming. Uh, if you want to become a member, I would love to have you on board to support this channel. You guys are awesome. Special shout out to all of you who are already members. I love you guys, man. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching this video. And until uh, I come back with another one, I'm out. Nice work, everyone. Sharp broadcast. Really good. Everyone on the floor as well. Really a lot of hustle. I liked it.